Yes, guys, so we have finally made it. We have finally passed the weekend, guys. We're back for another Monday reaction vibrations. I'll be dropping two of them, guys. Of course, welcome to DC uh, Mr. Licks reaction, to the guys. I'll be dropping another one on the BRBP TV platform. So, definitely looking for the vibrations a bit later on, right there. Of course, that link will be the first comment in the comment box, too, guys. Welcome to each and every one of you, guys. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. I would appreciate that. Click the thumbs up button. And with that said, guys, let us get into the vibrations for today. Now, guys, I remember some time back. I was reacting to some upcoming projects in Dominica. And I was like, what on earth is going on? Where are these projects? They're talking about golf course and all sorts of things that they got to be doing for 2024. For which we know Dominica is pretty much struggling when it comes down to doing projects. And of course, funds coming. We, we owe the outside world a lot of money. Far less to meet our own debt obligation in Dominica. I remember some time ago, guys, it was 1.5 billion. Of course, under the DLP administration, it moved from 200 million to about 1.5 billion dollars. It went down to about 1.1. And right now, we have no clue where the debt ratio is. For sure, we know it's going up. But of course, brothers and sisters, you know, this is why a number of persons are saying that Dominica doesn't have much money and what have you. But um, I remember the project that they stated that, that, stated that they were going to be doing. And I did not see the aerial tram video. I was like, where is it? You guys remember when I asked if they're doing all these projects, where exactly is the aerial tram video? But of course, um, I'm here today to announce to you that apparently it is it is it is being done, brothers and sisters. It is actually being done. Look at the terrain of the nature out of the Caribbean, man. People are staying on top there, people are staying on there, under there, people are staying over there. <laughs> that's that's an interesting scope. But, anyways, guys. Let us take a look at the whole vibrations that they want to do. Cable car, Dominica, brothers and sisters. And apparently, this is the area that they're going to be working on right there. So, based on the designs, guys, we could clearly see that this is what they actually stated that they're going to be doing. On the basis of the designs, it looks exactly like what the designs is. We know in Dominica, when they come and talk about designs, brothers and sisters, you have to be mindful that sometimes the... The, the end result doesn't look like the design, you know, so it kind of looks like it right there. So there is hope, brothers and sisters, but work is being done. So that is always a good thing right there. Fellas, I work. Dominicans doing it. Give this video a thumbs up. We've seen some Dominicans being there. That is a good thing right there, guys. <laughs> that is a wonderful thing right there. Bending metal. Metal benders, man. Yes, I... Who is that now? Is that a local? Anyways, we don't know. But let's hope it's a local. Hmm. Job work, can we? Yes, I. Okay. So apparently this is the area right there. Um. Hmm. I'm trying to figure out the top, the, the northern part. Or maybe just the bottom of this thing. Anyways, let's continue. This is an overview of it right there, guys. More Dominicans. That's what I love to see. That is what I love to see. That is what I love to see, man. Dominicans in the building. Whoever this company is, big up all yourself, eh? For at least saying, you know what, guys? I think we need to make the Dominicans come and be a part of this thing. Thank God for that. That's all I'm asking, brothers and sisters. Is, it that, is that too much to ask for? This guy's not a Dominican. Well, I don't My think he's My name is Randall Blakey. I'm uh, the construction manager here at the ABL project, the Cable Car Dominica. Dominica. So we're building a 10 passenger cable car and each cabin can hold 10 passengers. We have- So it's a 10 passage um, cable car. I'm guessing each of them um, will be able to hold 10 individuals, up to 10 individuals. Is there a weight limit to it? Because I know sometimes um there is a weight limit some people might be big and bold and beautiful brothers and sisters and they might be three people so i'm, I'm is there a weight weight thing in there Passage. because you don't want the rope to burst brothers and sisters of a All thousand right. persons per hour a thousand persons direction. this cable car will be the longest single section cable car in the world hmm. this i mean we have seen that is what they're telling us okay why is that it looks like a boiling lake or something. Interesting. The project began with planning and preparation in January of 2022, and our completion date is targeted for December of 2025. 
Okay. So we have about we have about two more years remaining for this to be completed, guys. They gave us a date. Um so hopefully by 2025 individuals will be able to cable car across the place at least that'll help the tourism industry in terms of persons not having to hike to boiling lake which of course i mean if some individuals definitely want to hike they can definitely hike but if you don't want to hike alas your food hurting you <laughs> alas yo it's not good brothers and sisters to go on them kind of hikes that you can hop on the cable car so that is always a good thing Current right phase there. is assembling the, the tower structures and in the jungle what you don't see here is uh, preparation for all of these tower elements to be set. So we have to construct anchors and foundations in the jungle for the various So this is the, the thing that's going to be built to hold the, 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 um, the rope. I remember if you guys remember I was actually on a cable car in Dominican Republic. You guys can actually go check that out on uh, Mr. Lick's vlogs channel. Um, just type in Mr. Lick's cable car or aerial tram. I call, I think I call it aerial tram um, right there. And it's pretty epic, no doubt about it. Very nice going all, all the way up from the bottom. Just going up, man. And, you know, it, it was a bit scary, no doubt about it. <laughs> it was a bit scary. But, you know, I is man, man. I have to, you know, <laughs> put that aside. Put the fears and the scaredness aside. Throw it to the back, you know, and I did make it all the way up. <laughs> I would try to shake the car from time to time, you know, be in trouble. Some if some of my other folks that were there, you know, and they were, you know, a bit scared, but you know, we made it, man. So hopefully, I'm getting, I hopefully get to see one in Dominica. I'm not believe I, like I said, told you guys, once Scared state stated this, I don't believe anything. I, I see all this thing happening. That's great, but I have to touch it with my bare hands for me to believe anything that is happening, brothers and sisters. I have to touch it with my bare hands. So let's hope that this does come into fruition and any sort of different derailments doesn't take place. In the next month, we're going to complete that phase. All of this machinery will be assembled. Then after Christmas, we've got a, a large heavy lift helicopter coming, hmm. which will be used to install all of this tower equipment that you're seeing in the background. Our flying will take us approximately four weeks, so there's a lot of components that have to be ready. Hmm. Once that stage is complete, then it sets the stage for getting things rolling to get the main cable car installed. So we purchased a couple of self-contained trucks from India that are a four-wheel drive and so we can use them in i guess they can go through the, the mud they can go through the grind very remote locations currently we're carrying concrete in them to one of the tower sites that's very close <laughs> to our staging area here and then once we're complete don't get stuck no please don't get stuck but <laughs> the area in this immediate vicinity we'll take them via the material ropeway to the top station where they'll be used to mix and cast the concrete for the top station foundations and the top station building. I I, I, I like what I'm seeing, guys. And, I, and I'm very excited to see all the Dominicans working there. I don't know if they just did this for the video. Hopefully, the Dominicans are continuously working right there because we know they tend to give most of the jobs to foreigners, outsiders, brothers and sisters. When they are Dominicans, I can do the jobs. They are Dominicans, I can do the jobs. So I'm very much excited to see all the Dominicans working them in. At the other site that we have... That, that is the interesting thing for me right there. What is that? Is that a, a hole with water flowing in, in, into it or something? Is, is that... Did they dig this or was this there before? We're constructing the parking lot and the uh, bottom station area where people will load into Fantastic. the cable car. There will be uh -huh. amenities for passengers that uh, just want to do a little shopping and so forth. So currently we're employing approximately 140 people. The people come from the areas near here, um, Loda primarily, Trafalgar. Guys, I love to hear that. I, I, I love to hear that, brothers and sisters. Dominica. Beautiful. Hey, I'm excited because, guys, I know that is, that is a rarity. Dominicans are put on the back burner. I'm happy to see this happening. Yes, man. And the employing individuals within the vicinity, within the vicinity, individuals who have the talent and skills, they don't have it, they will learn. I love that. But obviously, hopefully, they go for the individuals who are talented and skilled and pay them adequately as well in that regard. Yes, man. 
That's something good. I love that. On Prosper, we reach out as far as uh, Point Michelle, ah. Mon Daniels. We're employing males, females. We're making a significant impact in the local economy. Yes. There's beautiful. Ah. Yes, sir. Uh, a lot of people that are receiving good wages. We care about our employees. There are mm. tickets to getting this project completed. It has to take somebody from foreign to do that to us. We, it has to take somebody. <sighs> And uh, the excitement among them is is great. They see the you know the coming reality of having a, a a good project that will employ lots of people in the future. So right now the construction is fun. It's a very exciting. <laughs> he only don't know. I just happy to see that, hey guys. It's not me. I don't that I have no benefit to me, brothers. But I'm happy that the Dominicans are getting employed. That this is happening for Dominica. Dominicans are part of something that is theirs. Beautiful man. Project. It's going to that, that's some rivers down there. Well, we're passing over the tram. <laughs> we see the rivers. Definitely be a large tourist attraction on this island. And I think a jewel in the Caribbean. So it'll be nice for local tourists, cruise ship tourists, and so we're very happy to be here. I'm happy performing to. this construction. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. If, if only the airport was like that, eh? If only the airport. Yeah, the airport. But we thank you for the small mercies, man. From Dominican. Small mercies. And I like the fact that he said the wages are well. They are given adequate and well enough wages for which the workers are happy about, brothers and sisters. I'm guessing all these things is what they're gonna be assembling to put together to ensure that we have a, 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 a not just a, 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 a what they call it, cable car successful running cable car, but a, a safe cable car, brothers and sisters. I'm not gonna lie, what's scary? Eh? <laughs> it's scary. And we're going up here, eh? gas side the cable car does burst. I don't know put it in there, but I'm just thinking these things. I say, boy, that does burst. I think him. What for me to hold now, boy? I'll be like Tarzan, the swinging boy. Anyways, <laughs> yes, and it's not they, not they didn't just wipe out the whole thing, you know. Say, oh, let's make up. They they cut a few areas where things are supposed to go, and and I, and it looks like a promise. It look it looks it looks like something, man. Ah, it's just unfortunate that you know. This is one. I'm I'm happy at least we get one. Thank God for one at least one you know at least one so I'm, I'm excited about this i'm excited about it guys I, I i don't know about you but i'm excited dominicans are involved in the building process this is a dominican thing you know dominicans will participate in it foreigners will also participate in it i'm excited there's still a preservation of nature in that aspect you see in the mountainosity <laughs> of oh, off it guys so you know we can just hope and pray for the best they're not chinese that building it so we know there's a level of more safety to it and of course i'm very excited guys are you excited i'm excited what are your thoughts guys this is just my thoughts what are your thoughts leave your thoughts in the comment box comment box below guys and of course with that said tune in to the next reaction i'll be doing on the brbptv platform that link will be posted a bit later on in the first comment in the comment box below guys so definitely tune in on that for that or go to the brbptv to platform and um, youtube platform and subscribe to the channel right there and then subscribe with the notification by clicking the bell after you subscribe and click all brothers and sisters so you can get all notifications when i drop them right there and then subscribe to this one as well and of course get this video a thumbs up for the dominicans working man the dominicans working kind of reminds me of grenada vibe i can't just grenade. a happiness does hold me man. <laughs> a happiness does hold me you say hello, hello. you know brothers and sisters kind of give me that grenadian vibe man Anyways, guys, what are your thoughts, man? Leave your thoughts in the comment comment box below, guys. Do you believe this is gonna be um, coming to um, fruition? Uh, do you think that it'll be done in a timely manner when it comes down to 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 building this stuff? What are your thoughts, guys? You know, a lot of things don't seem to add up when it comes down to Dominic, but I have faith in this. I have much faith in this one. I do have faith in the airport yet. I do have faith in the stadium. Any anyway, we, we we know that goes with brothers and sisters. 
but I do have faith in this one. I'm happy to see this. What are your thoughts? Leave your thoughts in the comment, comment box below, guys. I'm with us. I'll see you guys in the next reaction video. Remember, guys, be real, be positive.